today we're going to show you an easy way to re-thread the bolts located on the flange bracket on a Lansing water pump using an M8 by 1.25mm helicore kit. The flange bracket holds the pump case securely to the machine. Therefore, with consistent vibration over time, this could have an effect on the bolt and the threads. Before starting, you will want to remove all the components attached to the flange bracket. To determine the size of the helical needed to re-thread, you will need to use the original bolt to find the diameter. Measure the diameter with a caliper. And pitch the size of each thread on a spring using a screw pitch gauge. Get the 8mm drill bit provided in the helical kit, then drill out the hole using a power drill. Now, using the tap from the helical kit, knowing the size and the pitch, place this in a ratchet to easily re-thread the hole. Place the ratchet in straight. Start off slowly to make sure you have aligned the tap correctly. Turn until you have re-threaded the hole and then release by unscrewing the ratchet. Now get the insulation tool and adjust so you know the measurement of the hole depth for the new insert. When you know the size, attach the spring on the end of the tool, making sure the tang is in the slot. Now place this in the hole, twisting the new helical until it's secure. This should be half a turn below the surface. Do not twist against the direction of the thread, as this could damage the spring. Then, to remove the tang at the end of the spring, gently tap this with the brake tool provided. You can now reattach the parts back, including the check valve and the suction flange. Align the bolts and washers back and then tighten with a 30mm socket spanner. That's how you re-thread the bolts located in the flange bracket on a Lansin water pump using an M8 by 1.25mm helicore kit. All the parts and tools needed for this task are listed in the description below. Please like, share and subscribe if you found this video helpful.